Hello guys, this is the second tutorial of Node Red for Dummies. And in this tutorial we are going to see how the slider node and the gauge node works. So in order in order to find the nodes we are going to scroll down in this part. And here as you can see in the dashboard part we can find the slider node. The slider and the gauge node. Now we are going to join these nodes. And these functions we saw in the last video that saves information, saves data in a string. And the function is here, you can type in your node also. And we are going to program the slider. Okay, we are going to... You can also create new groups or you can add the slider to a group you have already created. Okay, we are going to add to this group, update, to a hello world group. Oh. Better we are going to add to this group and the range is going to be from 4 to 20 and fine in further videos i will show you how i am working from from to 20 for example it's because pressure transmitters flow transmitters work with from 220 milliamps output that's the reason i am working here with that with those values but it isn't important now you can choose the values you need okay and you're going to program the gauge okay, we can add this group also and the values from 4 to 20 good Level gauge. Okay. Now we are going to deploy it and see how it works. Check here in the dashboard. And here we can see the slider from 4 to 20. And you can move the slider and as you can see the graphical interface is very nice mm, as i told you in the last video if you want that this is in the internet in the internet now because i am using a cloud for hosting no red if you are working on your raspberry pi it exists uh, node called fret and you can send information from the raspberry pi to a server but this i'm going to explain you in further videos for the moment i need you to understand how the slider node works and the gauge node works okay here we can change the type of the type we can see the donut type and deploy it. You see here from 4 to 20. Here. Okay, the donut type. We can change to compass type. We deploy it and we can see here the compass. Okay. And put here the unit, for example, milliamps. Just to show you how it works. You can change also the type, the title. And the level done. Deploy it. 
here you can you can see the level guys and now we are going to change for example the step to one and deploy it now you see that I change okay guy this is all for the tutorial number two i hope you like it and subscribe and motivate me to make more videos see you in the tutorial number three bye